and I've made sure to load it without its UV so I can show you the uh, the magic one tool. So let's go to polygon mode because that is only visible in polygon mode. So there we go. And I'm going to turn on curved. So you're probably all familiar with this um, setup from the last version of Ryzen UV. You can choose coplanar or curved and you can actually choose your max angle uh, of what's going to be chosen. And you can also use the geo normals. So all of this was already in um, Ryzen UV. But we've got a auto unfold feature. So let's check this on and select some of these um, islands based on this max local angle. So if I click on this, say I want this piece of the leg broken out, I can click on it and it will automatically unfold it. Well, not just unfold it, but cut it from the model and unfold it afterwards. And I can do the same with this piece here. So it will do that. What's even nicer is with this first, I've, I've just controlled Z there to go back one. You can actually add to your selection as well. So let me go back to the beginning. I'm going to click this first one again and then go to this second one. And it, if I hold down my add button, in my case, it's shift. Um, I can add this to my selection. So now if I click this, not only does it automatically unfold this extra selection I've made, but it welds it to the first bit. So if I uh, scoot round and maybe, oh, I don't know, add that, you can see that it's been added to this. There's no cut there. It welds it. So you can actually slowly pick apart and unwrap a piece of this model and you could you can see it sort of taking shape and unfolding in your UV space you can even deselect islands as well so an example of this is these islands that were selected uh, sorry these islands that were welded together and unfolded um, Uh, they will be cut and unfolded independently so you can actually go for your other button and it will get broken away from this so if i do that here as well in fact let's bring this uh, max angle down a little bit so i can there we go select that and i can hold my control button like i said in your case it may be different i'm using the c4d control layout if you're using another one your shift and control buttons may be reversed so if I hold down control here and select this, it gets broken off and cut and re-unfolded. Also, the island that it gets broken away from gets unfolded again independently on its own. So yeah, we really, really think that that's a great um, addition to the Magic Wand tool because it, it really does mean that you can see it happening before your eyes. You can just pick it apart and... Uh, you can sort of go, mm, that didn't unfold the way that I wanted to, it to, or I imagined it would. And you can sort of go back or, see, or even come back later and say, actually, I think I can put more bits on this and it would be good. So anyway, I'll stop rambling <laughs> and move on to the next feature that is in Ryzen UV. I hope you like that, guys. I really do. Because, um, yeah, I was quite happy with that one. Mm -hmm.